today I'm going to be reviewing a game that I have played on this channel. If you haven't been sticking around with the channel since June 2019, then you won't know this, but the first game that I ever completed from literally start to finish, super hot. Graphic didn't come up on the screen. Hey, come it. Super hot. <laughs> Uh, not super hot VR. A lot of people are like, oh, it's just super hot, but it's in VR. It's not. It's it's the same story, but it's two different stories in a way. If you have normal super hot and super hot VR, please play both of them. Both of them are incredibly creepy. Both of them have very interesting storylines. Let's get into this. Evil, 6 out of 10. For those of you who may not know, spoiler warning if you have not played Super Hot yet. Actually, I'll spoil the warning at the end of the video. So stick around until the end. <laughs> Overall, 8 out of 10. It was a really good, really great shooter game. The concept of time stops when you stop is really cool. So, obviously, violence, 7 out of 10. It's a shooter game. If you shoot a red guy in the head, like, the... He turns into triangles and breaks all over the place. Uh, so I guess it's a little bit like blood, but not really. It's violent, for sure. Uh, there are swords. You can sword fight them. You can cut the red dudes in half. You can shoot the red dudes with a bunch of different guns. You can throw stuff at them. You can bash stuff against red dudes. You can grab a red dude and bash them against something. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's definitely a little bit more on the violent side for a video game. And the horror aspects. Obviously, there's like two or three jump scares throughout the game. And there's a much darker meaning to the game, and I'm about to explain it. So, it's still fun, and it's definitely worth playing if you have it. Uh, now, for the spoiler warning. If you haven't played Super Hot, stop, stop, stop. Close off this video right now. Or, if you don't care about playing Super Hot, go ahead and continue. So, really, what's happening in Super Hot is you're surrendering your mind over to the program the further you go in the game also I will leave the playlist linked top link in the description down below basically you're surrendering your mind to the core over time and at the very end of the game you do surrender the core and you get full access to the game you can go back and play any level you've previously played you can do endless mode and it's it's creepy I'm not gonna lie I did not enjoy sitting there and not being able to see behind me. That was relatively creepy. But uh, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this video, this review of Super Hot. And until the next time, guys, I will talk to you all later. But do you know the way? Okay, goodbye.